Hello everyone, welcome to Illustra Plants. My name is Crystal Cedar and today I am super very excited to share with you an unboxing of my recent Happy Planner haul from the Happy Planner website. Happy Planner was offering 40% off selected items plus an additional 15% off if you have, um, if you're a VIP rewards member. So I had to jump on it because these were items that I have been waiting a year, over a year I think, for to go on sale um, that never came back to my Joann's as exclusives because they originally released at Joann's as exclusives. And so I was just like, well, it's now or never for what I want to do with it for the rest of this year, for the next uh, six months. So let's go ahead and get in this box. I just opened it and remove the address label so I haven't really looked through it yet All right okay so what we'll do is we'll unpack the box and then we'll go through it one by one these are the items out of the box and what I'll do is I'll go through the big items first and then the smaller items afterwards uh, to kind of go over what my intention was of this haul or this haul purchase first two things that I got were these two photo memory keepers so the first one is called life is a journey and then the second one is called seek magic i saw these two in joann's last year and i was not able to grab them in time my joann's had only like one of each and i think it was uh this one that i bought but then is actually defective on the inside somebody had gone through and been really lame with it so with the guts and so i had to return it it wasn't worth it to keep for 43 dollars um it was definitely also to an investment that i wasn't planning on making at the time um, but i'm really thankful that the happy planner finally put them on sale for 40% off plus an additional 15% off for VIP rewards and that it was restocked. I've been watching these on the website since they were restocked in spring. So there's this photo journal um, and then I got the Seek Magic one as well which is the one that I originally had wanted but my Joann's didn't have in stock. The intention of this purchase was I wanted to go back to creating a grimoire using a disc bound system and when the happy planner came out with these kind of like pre-made uh, memory keeping scrapbooking photo journaling pages I was like no dude that's a grimoire I can't lag anymore <laughs> so my grimoires in the past have been about a little bit bigger than this actually because they were pretty ornate leather bound you know with like ribbon and like lots of ephemera and all the crafty things um, to keep track of kind of like my ascension process as a crystal journal as I started like going towards like my crystal journey and then um, just my regular crafting like green witch uh, elemental and crystal witch kind of like uh, stuff <laughs> all of it and I think I haven't kept a grimoire in the past five years that was like an official grimoire just because I didn't have the time and also too because of the events happening in the world, there are just more important things happening. Also, I didn't want to go back to using a bound kind of journal system. My last grimoire that I used was actually just a binder, like a, a three ring binder, which is about the same size as this. And um, I would just use a lot of parchment paper and kind of like tea dye a lot of pages. And it was a little too time consuming for me. And also it was kind of... Um, kind of ghetto that I would just be using like binder paper for my journaling pages and so when I started using the happy planner in 2018 I really thought that this disc bound system or a disc bound system whether it was happy planner or not would be the best way to go if I were ever to do another formal grimoire that didn't really include um, a lot of like magic stuff in it this is something that I want to pass down for my nieces and my nephews to look at later um, if they need like assistance in their magical journey plus there's things that are just involved in our kind of like indigenous shamanic family that um, they can use you know as teenagers or maybe as young adults later on remedies um, kind of like cleanses and things like that that they could use these are the two deluxe ones that I've been waiting for and really excited to get so two photo journals to be Happy Planner Grimoires or Magical Craft Journals. 
next things I got were the extension packs because uh, apparently there are some things in the extension packs that are not necessarily in the journals. So the two that I got were the one that go with the Seek Magic, although I think there will be repeats of like pages and dividers. I just love the design so much. It's like an extension of the Desert Blooms uh, planner that I was using the dividers and the cover of from earlier this year. I loved all of that design. The colors were just so cute. And it comes with this folder. So um, in the big size, which does not come in the deluxe album, I don't think. And it comes with these stickers and all the things. So I'm not going to do a flip through of them yet, but I just wanted to show that I got that one. And then this one was called Retro Blooms. This was a different deluxe cover, but deluxe cover photo memory keeper, but I didn't want the whole planner. I just wanted to see if I liked it enough for the pages. And that's kind of like a preview. I, this was the one actually that I saw and I was just like, this is a grimoire. <laughs> like, I don't care what you say, this is a grimoire. <laughs> like as Christian as Happy Planner is, I know this is a grimoire because my pages in my old grimoires looked very similar to this using scrapbook paper. Back in the day when I was in high school, I'd have to use magazines. So I used a lot of like um, Better Homes and Gardens <laughs> pages of magazines for my grimoire pages just to get like this kind of background. And then I would just like journal on top of that with parchment paper or whatever I had on hand. Because back in those days, we did not have the internets or Pinterest. But that is the Retro Blooms extension pack. Oh, it also comes with a folder. So this is the folder. I was like, that is so like Lunasa Mabin vibes right there. With that, I also got two packs of the Happy Memory Keeping uh, photo page protectors. There's 12 pages in each, and then you get three sheets of each design, and I think there's four designs, so kind of like this right here. Um, there's like smaller ones, and let's go look at the breakdown here. Yeah. So four different designs. I don't really print out like picture paper photos, but I might <laughs> with this grimoire system. I just didn't have a way of like storing it or didn't know what it was gonna look like. I'm not really interested in like gluing down pictures necessarily like I used to, um, but we'll see. That's why I got these, just to kind of feel things out. Also too, if you know, I have little ephemeris or journaling cards or, you know, little dried plants or something that I don't want to necessarily glue or commit to paper. I can at least put them in these is what I was thinking. So I got two of them. I also picked up this planner sleeve bundle because uh, actually for the things inside, <laughs> the, the sleeve is just kind of a bonus, but I forgot that this was actually being offered. So uh, this is supposed to be able to fit a classic sized happy planner. We'll see about that. <laughs> or maybe a really chunky mini happy planner and a couple of mini sticker books is what I was thinking. So I got the planner sleeve bundle. I also picked up the mini pen pouch. It's got like a soft, weird vinyl on it. I always wanted this, but I just never picked it up when Oasis was out. Uh, because it was always sold out at my Joann's and then um, once it got on sale on the website I just had other things that I needed to make a priority as a purchase. So this is This is like I love that whole Disney Oasis line. It was so cute and it was so happy for last summer. So I got that That's it right there. I also picked up a half sheet of the botanicals Blooms, I forget what it was called, but I liked how it was some of the pages were pink and then some pages were just kind of like this white graph and some were lined and I figured those would be really pretty to cut up and use as um, writing paper for my grimoire other than using the pages inside of the memory keepers themselves. And then last but not least, I got an extra lined notebook, ha uh, happy mini for the paper mostly because it's just plain lined straight up plain lined paper and then I think it had like a magical kind of situation on the binding part so those were the items that I got in my recent 
copy planner. I'm going to call this the memory keeping kind of sale because basically it was all the memory keepers. And then now I'm going to go through, uh, I'm going to go through this bundle for sure. And then to open one of these each just to kind of see what's inside. Okay. So this is the planner sleeve bundle. And I believe it was $24.95, the price of this on the website. It's just fabric. I was always curious about them. I know there was like a pink blush one. Um, I believe there was like a white floral one as well. And I wasn't sure if it was vinyl or not, but this is just straight up fabric. Like you could probably put this in the washing machine kind of fabric. So that's good to know. This, however, is like a faux suede on the end. And inside you get a home body sticker book which I figured I could use for grim warring possibly I have one of these that I haven't even used yet already it might be de-stashed I'm not sure yet but you get a home body sticker book and this is the main reason why I got it was for the extender metal discs because with a grimoire especially in a big size I already know I'm gonna need extent expander discs because it's going to get chonky and also I want to be able to use like different elements that you would find in a grimoire like ephemera, chonky scrapbook paper, pockets and ribbons and crushed velvet and things like that. So I knew I was going to need extender discs or expander discs but for the price of what they were on the Happy Planner website I might as well have just gotten this bundle because it was on sale and then also like okay fine I could do stash this and then possibly be able to use this to carry at least a mini so let's test it out okay so I've got a classic happy planner this was a lined one that I got on clearance like two years ago that'll probably use the cover for fall but let's see how it fits oh and the lining is um, it's just like a like a poly blend with like a poly blend I would say it's not even stitched into the bag or into the pouch so it's kind of nice if you have like crumbs or anything it'll be easy to pull out but yeah that's <laughs> that's interesting that it's not even stitched into the pouch sleeve but whatever it's okay I'm gonna try it okay so discs on the outside are gonna be the best I think and all right that looks pretty cozy Okay, so good to know that it actually fits a classic sized Happy Planner and maybe some extra stuff in there. I'm going to try it now with my mini Happy Planner Grimoire, which I'll go through in a minute. Because it would be nice to be able to put this in here with my backpack. Because my backpack can get kind of funky and I don't want this to get messed up. Like while it's tossed around in my backpack so let's see it'll fit my mini and then try this pen pouch this is like the old squad goals pen pouch just to kind of see and then let's try this sticker book okay so sticker books are gonna have to be put in like sideways or horizontal for it to fit yeah that'll work cool Perfect. Nice. Next, I want to kind of go through this and then this is the extension pack. So what I'll do is I'll open both and then we'll compare the pages on the inside to see if they're exactly the same because I wasn't sure if they were or not on the website. So open these up and then let's see. First off, <laughs> on opening this, I just uh, kind of opened it and it seems like the glue or adhesive that was used to kind of keep this on this cover is kind of oiled out <laughs> and it's kind of gross. So I'm going to wipe this off first before we continue, but I just wanted to show that on here in case one of y'all buy this on the website and experience this as well. I mean, thank goodness it's just a uh, polyurethane, right? Not leather. So I got most of that funky stuff off and now let's open it. So just wanted to show these really cute clear gold glitter discs. They're so cute. And there's a pink tint on the 
plastic here. So this doesn't go all the way to the binding. It just goes right there and it's pink. So that's cute. Okay, so first page. Get the little photo layouts. Cute little stickers right here. Okay, so this is where the comparison begins. This is the same divider. Oh, okay. So I'm thinking it's going to be the same because they're already the same right here. And I like how it does tell you the size of the photos that you should be printing out. And the paper is Happy Planner paper, which is another reason why I chose to do this for my Grimoire method. Uh, it's a heavier weight. It's like got really beautiful prints, kind of like the energy that I want to go for with for this new Grimoire. And then I love all of these little cute little magical icons on the side, like the stars and the moons, super cute. So they're the same, and that's the same. If it's the same after five pages, then we're just going to assume that it's the same, and I'll just continue the flip through on this. Oh, it's the same. It's kind of blank. It looks like this. And last page, and then I think I'll just continue the flip through here and just know that it's the same exact one. Yep, the pages are exact. Boom. So I'll go ahead and move these over. And then we'll finish the flip through and then we'll go through the additional accessories that you get with the extension pack separately. So that's that nice blank sheet of paper. And then it's dot grid on the back. It gives you a lot of room for ephemera, scrapbooking, kind of like craft journaling. It, it gives you a lot of possibilities or it gives you really good suggestions of like maybe do a photo story here of something. So I liked I liked it for that. This is lined paper, lined paper, and then there's actually like three squares that are blank. So that could be easily for like a cut apart from a scrapbook paper pad and then kind of like documentation. In a grimoire, I would use this for possibly like herbs, like photos of herbs and then documentation of what each one does or the benefits of each one. Look at this. Oh my gosh. And the little icons continue on the side too. <laughs> That's just so cute. I really don't have time to print out pages like this and then do all of this onto it. So such a luxury that you can already get a kit that's already set for you. So this is really pretty. And then this is just blank pages, one big full and then divided into three. It says so much fun on the bottom. It's got this. I'm just going to do a quicker flip through. Okay, cool. So it kind of repeats a little bit. This is the second divider, double sided. There's that third divider that even goes into the tab, which is so cute. And then that's the back with the Joshua tree in the background. Joshua tree is amazing. So it's, it's, it's like one of the most alien places you can be in California. And this one is adventure is calling. And then this is the back of that. And I must go. <laughs> All right, so that is the Seek Magic. Oh, you can still kind of see that stuff, but um, Seek Magic, Photo Memory Keeper Deluxe, and then now let's go through the extras that you get in the extension pack that are different than that. So here are all the pages. Just make sure they're not getting messed up. I was also considering, like, because I love this line so much that I might actually trim some down to put back into my classic Happy Planner, just as dividers. And also, like, maybe frame it. I don't know. But I love these dividers so much. And with the sale, it was great. So I got an extra one. Okay, so I think this is where the accessories begin right here. So you get two sheets of stickers, it looks like. And this is on clear sticker paper. So collect moments, not things. Dream. Let's get lost. Good times while the hard adventure is calling. And then cute little icons. I love the art of this whole thing. And then these are paper. 
and it's just kind of like banners uh, tabs <laughs> I guess these stickers here and these are gold foil corners which will be really cute for some photos and then this is the folder it's so pretty this is actually coated with something it's not like just straight up paper I don't know if you can pick that up it's got like a, a, a slick kind of coating on it and it says create your own adventure on front and back that is just so pretty I'm thinking about definitely trimming one of these down for my classic. Next up we have the Life is a Journey photo journal and the Retro Blooms extension pack. I already know that these two are not going to be the same, they're two different con collections, uh, but I kind of want to do a quick flip through of each one, at least of the dividers so you get an idea of what they look like. And um, I checked this just now and that same funky residue it's like melted adhesive is on this one as well as was on the seek magic one so i'm just gonna wrap that off and clean it off also i kind of wanted to show that it was also on the back page adhesive too like that melty funky adhesive stuff so when you are if you get these from the happy planner website make sure that you take these off first because it gets everywhere it's gross. I'm gonna go through the Life is a Journey photo memory journal first, and then we'll go through the Retro Blooms extension pack. So you open it up. These covers are really uh, floppy. It's like two layers of vinyl with a not so solid cardstock cardboard on the inside. Like I feel like just doing that folded that <laughs> a little bit. It's fine. It's a grimoire. It's supposed to look aged and stuff, but out of all the covers I thought this one looked the most like a grimoire cover and I think in the future I'll probably create my own grimoire covers out of chipboard and fabric and all the witchy things This also uh, plastic by the binding is clear whereas on the Seek Magic one it was pink. So there's that I think this one had more of a, like it looked more like a Grim Warp, the pages did. So you get a tiny little sheet of stickers right here. Life is short, live it, love is rare, grab it, memories are sweet, cherish them. Okay, that's cute. <laughs> okay, so the first divider, there's a lot of beauty in ordinary things, and then it's got like this handmade paper kind of like background on it. Needs a better close-up view of that. Looks like textured paper basically. And then lots of blush. Lots of blush pink. So got that. That's really cute. I would replace this and put like a holiday, like a Sabbath. Like this would be cute for maybe I'll use this for Lunasa. Like Lunasa. And then just like some cute little correspondences or traditions there. That looks super grimoire right there. Where, when, and who. Like there's so many times I've gone to ceremony or I've gone on a pilgrimage or retreat where I wish I had this already so that I could just print out the pictures and then just bam, 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 and then put them down. But now I think I can kind of go back and maybe photo journal back plan that. This is the second page, a little bit of blush on dot grid. And then there's this. I really love the, the line florals on this. Really pretty. Just lots of blush. So much fun. And this is a uh, blank and blank dot grid lined paper. Lined paper, lined paper, blank. There's that happy page again, so I can do multiple sabbats. That's so cute. Oh, this would be cute for like crystals, like pictures of crystals. That would be cute. Or, yeah. I don't know, I saw this and I was like, crystals. There's that. So it's similar to the box layouts of Seek Magic, just with a different background. That, 
And this lined paper. I like these. Where it's kind of like blank. Three spots and then like a whole line of like lines. It's kind of nice. And then um, it's just going to repeat. So I'm going to just go through the dividers. So you can make a difference every day. Textured paper. It's a really pretty pistachio green like a very soft sagey pistachio green then the third divider is okay like for real though like that herbology <laughs> come on <laughs> on textured paper come on grimoire <laughs> That's totally speaking to my green witch heart right there. Lavender, some dried lavender in a jar. Apothecary vibes. And then this is the fourth divider. And what is coming is better than what is gone. And then it's that beautiful lined floral. So that is the Life is a Journey Deluxe. I mostly bought this for the cover. The inside guts are okay, but I think um, I like... As far as favorites go, I love the Seek Magic one. But the, for practical reasons, this will be great. And then let's get through the Retro Blooms extension pack. So this is the Retro Blooms extension pack. I was tempted to get the Deluxe as well, just for the cover. But um, it was like a very floral cover. I think it looked like this on the cover. And it just wasn't really... I'm, I'm not crazy about this Retro 70s font. It gives me like too funky vibes. <laughs> it's like a little too funky for me. Uh, so I just got the extension pack and plus two I wanted the goodies. So let's get into the Retro Blooms Memory Keeping Extension Pack. So off the bat, this is just gorgeous. A gorgeous, gorgeous turquoisey blue. It's a little bit brighter than I thought it would be. I love this pairing of this blue with this blush pink. And orange really pretty uh, also if you use a big happy planner and you just want to buy this extension pack for the dividers I think that would be a good move because look at that it's like if you have a note section or you just want to have kind of like a let me not stress out in my day kind of like brain dumping note taking part like if you're a teacher and you're using the, the big teacher's layout, like this would be a really nice calm spot in your planner where you could just turn and be like, let me just write out some restrictions real quick. <laughs> so really, really pretty divider. Oh, look, it's so cute. Look at that. Yeah, this was the, this was the pack that I saw that I was just like, okay, if I'm going to do this, I definitely want to use this. And I want to start it off with Maven and Lunasa. So. Those are the two holidays that are coming up for the fall. So I'm indigenous pagan and I observe all the Sabbaths. This is really pretty too. <laughs> I just love the touch that they added the icons to over the print. I think that's just so pretty. Lined paper here. And then you've got good times. The monarch. And these shadow boxes. He just declared this poor little butterfly a um, threatened species in California. I'm really bummed about that. And then there's this field here. Collect memory, collect moments, not things. And then the where, when, and who. I don't know, like, because fall's coming up. Like, if you do, like, the pumpkin patch, like, these pages would be really pretty for that. This is a beautiful dot grid with a cute little daisy, and this is beautiful blue again. Not really coming up, but it is a really pretty blue. And that, I would definitely cover that. Ooh, look at those. Like that, that one's really pretty. Visually, I think this one takes the cake compared to the other two. Maybe, well, first place and then second place, Seek Magic blank boxes and then this is just blank no lines or anything so if you just wanted to kind of like enjoy the page like that that'd be really pretty also what I was thinking like if I used the big planner this would be really cool for kind of like a memory or vision board in your everyday planner 
like this would be really cool and then you could just cover that up and put like I don't know something more motivational than so much fun that's lined this is dot grid this is lined lined look at, oh my goodness look at the cold copper foil on this divider look at that that all speckled all speckled with this beautiful copper gold foil copper foil super pretty it's not foiled on the other side but that is okay if there was one photo and all of this to encapsulate like all the autumn maven vibes this is it right here and foiled that is so pretty and let the memories begin is it the same let me just see if it's repeating Oh yeah, it, it, it's repeating. So each divider has the same. So now we're just gonna go through the dividers. So that was the second one, that gorgeous purple one. Oh, that's different. And then this is the third one. I love this, magenta, super pretty. And that's the other side. And then the third one is collect moments, not things. It's giving me like 70s album cover vibes. It's like the Carpenter's greatest hits. <laughs> I'm just not, I'm just not a fan of that. I'm just not a fan of that. <laughs> okay, so that is the pages. And I think this is different. Let's see. Oh no, it's the same. Okay. This is the folder that you do not get with the deluxe. And yeah, it's still coated the same way as the Secret Magic one was. It's really cool, I like it. It's like more stain resistant, not like you're gonna be like pouring coffee all over it or anything, but if it happens, it won't be as detrimental as just a regular cardboard with like the gloss. It's definitely waxy. That's a good size pocket, but that's really pretty. It says, find the joy. And these are the stickers, you get two sheets. So we've got paper with the monarchs with gold, or sorry, that copper foil, that copper foil, and then the arrows. And then these are the clear stickers. And this is happiness, memories, so much fun, good times, love this day, and fun times again. We've got monarchs. Very cute. If you're like going for those retro vibes, like very um, Elton John. <laughs> <laughs> kind of vibes early Elton John fangirl vibes like that's that's kind of what it's giving me a little bit so that is the retro blooms extension pack and for the last bit of this kind of like haul and kind of like unpacking I wanted to test out the pages in this memory keeping page protector pack uh, just to kind of see how it fits in here and then also to the size of the sheets because I've never really seen one before and I, I, I want to see it inside the planner so or the memory keeper so let's go check that out together what I'm get, thinking this residue is from is because of the heat waves that are going on right now like up here in San Francisco it's literally 60 65 degrees as a high and then right now in the evening at the time of this filming it's like 50s <laughs> With the heaters on and we're all wearing sweats <laughs> it's crazy uh but that's normal that's a normal san francisco summer like mark twain even said so like the coldest winter we ever felt was a summer in san francisco like that is that's is a real story true story and we haven't had that in a while and so i am um, i'm really thankful that it's nice and cold the way it should be but i'm very sorry for those that are experiencing a lot of discomfort with the super extreme heat like that's not cool Okay, so there's four different designs. So let's, what is this? Okay, what is, okay, so here's one of the designs. And then there's like this little plasticky thingy that I guess is keeping them together or upright. Wow, okay, so I'm gonna have to cut that because it's really in there. Okay. 
All right, so let's turn to a nice divider here. Okay, so the first ones are these large ones and you get three of um, each layout. So this is the big one, this is this size here. And then you've got three little square ones in the middle, four by six. Yeah, four by six would fit in the last one. So let's see what it looks like. Okay, so it's not the whole page, it's just kind of like a little bit of a margin. So if I were to put like a journaling card in here, sentiment, that'd be really cute. You could also put like tickets or something in here, ticket stubs. Okay, then the second one is like a single uh, four by six. I think and then you got a little smaller one enough for like a three by two ruler check this out it'd be enough for like a three by three by four so this would be like a three by four this would definitely fit a four by six yep and then let's see what that looks like okay so you could kind of move it around this has two, four, six, eight, nine holes. So let's see what this looks like actually in a classic. This is a classic, and this is that page from the Memory Keeper bunch. They have classic size Memory Keeper, but I've never seen this size before, where it's just like one single and then the little one, and that fits. Cute. So nice to know this fits also in a classic. Let me just put that in here. And then the next one is three pockets. So you've got one, two, and three. I don't know if you can see that there. There we go. You can kind of see the three sections there. And that would be good for a three by four wallet sized photo for sure. This would stick out a little bit on a classic. So that probably would not be a good fit, unless you're going to trim off the top disc right there. But then that would also cut into your picture space. Not like how the other one fit really well. So, this looks like in here. Like that. Okay, that's cute. I guess you could also adjust it to be on the top. Let's see what it looks like with the top and the bottom. just so that it's kind of layered, easier to turn. That's cute. Okay, and then the last size that you get design layout is this with multiple squares. So multiple two by twos. And you could do all kinds of stuff with this. You could print out two by twos for inspiration. You could do uh, scrapbook paper. And that is a full page. So that looks like this in there. So that would be like for the full length, just like the first one. Yeah, the first one is like that too. Let's try this on a different divider. What I would love to put in this is like dried herbs or like some seeds. I think that would be really cute for my grimoire. And then like on the back would be like a card where I could kind of like write what it means or maybe write on the front and then put the herb in there. I don't know, I haven't figured it out yet, but I think that would be so cute. Kind of like an Ostara situation. I think that would be so pretty. All right, cool. So you get 12 sheets of these designs. And unfortunately right now on the Happy Planner website, which is the only place I've ever seen them on sale for sale, it, it's sold out because of the sale, I'm guessing. So I don't know if you can buy this on the Joann's website, but it's definitely a good thing to grab. I believe these are about uh, under $10 a pack, possibly. I'll pop it up right here, pop, so that you can see what that is like. And it's definitely for the memory keeping journals specifically, or the big size. So if you have a big size planner, which I don't, then you can also use it for that. And on top of keeping a big sized happy planner grimoire or big grim happy grimoire i guess you can call it um or a disc bound spiritual creative journal i'm gonna also be keeping a small mini happy planner sized grimoire 
this ground as well because I want to be able to take one with me when I go to cafes or when I go to like um, the certain like mystical shops in the city and around the Bay Area and I want to take it to go so I got an extra notebook with just regular plain line paper so let's crack into this this was from I think this was called Celestial and I don't remember this being a planner but it's kind of nice it's very muted like the cover very simple but look how pretty that is silver foil the inside covers dark surprise surprise it's a stargazery theme thing and it's dark and then the dividers it's just real simple so elements of the zodiac so we've got earth air water fire let's see if they're right okay they're right <laughs> And then, because it's a notebook, there's nothing on the other side of the divider, so very easily, if that irritates you, then you can also flip it and then do it like that. But I just wanted more writing paper. Oh my gosh, and this writing paper is adorable. I might have to go back and order more. That's got the cutest little simple star on the side. Um, it's a college ruled length, so that's good. And it has like a cute little header almost like super on the under header. So if you wanted to write the day and the date, like a journal journal, that would be cute. And then that's the other side. So it's, these are the dividers with all, so this one is the moon with all the zodiac signs, Cancer, we've got Aries, Taurus, Pisces, all of them, everybody's here. And then that's the back side of that one. In case you wanted to flip it to be like this. That'll also work. And then it'll also work this way too. If I wish I had centered that better so that it would look a little better, but put like a sticker on the top if you don't want that. And then the line paper doesn't change, it's the same. And oh, this one's pretty. And then it has like stars, and then um, I don't think those are like the constellations. Well, yeah, I guess. Yeah, they're the constellations of these signs. So we've got Sagittarius, Taurus, Cap. Leo, Pisces, Scorp, Aries, Libra. See, that's everybody. 12. And then it can, it's the same print on the other side. It's very, it's actually like a really pretty gray with just a little bit of blue. It's pretty. Prettier color than this. <laughs> and then that is just for the guts and possibly I'll, I can use this as a divider. So that is my recent Happy Planner haul with the photo memory keeping uh, sale. It was 40% off select items, but including the photo memory keeping line. And then an additional 15% off if you are a VIP rewards member. And uh, this is going to be my grimoire. <laughs> like all the ingredients for my disc bound magical creative journal aka grimoire so if you are interested in kind of seeing how i'm going to set that up uh stay tuned and yeah enjoy i hope if you got the same things with the same intention of crafting a creative journal like let's do this let's do this this fall and winter and we can make it fun so thank you so much and may we all aspire to find energetic balance and connection to our own loving spirit and inner brightness today until next time friends and paws everybody take care Bye bye